for coming back to my channel today. I want to do a Christmas haul and this is from multiple stores and I I don't think I'm gonna put in any type of order because it's been it's collective and so today I went to Michael's because it was some things on my list and then I want I was happy that they finally got this up 40% off because you know when they first put it out it's not 40% off it's just they wait probably after Halloween and then now it's 40% off and then I was going to use Joanne's additional 25% off so let me show you what I picked up most of the items I think are from Dollar General and then I got some stuff from Big Lots that I forgot to show and then they had some coupons and then I went back so I hope you guys don't mind it like this and I don't have any any makeup I'm fresh face and I hope my lights aren't too bright and putting off a glare so I don't yeah I don't have any makeup so this is me <laughs> no makeup my circles and everything it's hereditary okay guys so let's start over here um and I'll try to do close-ups if it's too close or if it's too far away um, I'll see when I'm editing but I wanted this joy and it's just like the other one I got for fall and it's a reform it's like feels like a reform but it's like a frame and it was twenty dollars and I got it they had a coupon so I got this last weekend I wish the bow was a little different but I guess if you could do a different bow if you want if it's that serious but it's not so I had a coupon I think five off of 15 and then I had like a 10 off of 50 or it was 20 or 25 off 75 coupon so I just did separate transactions so that I could um take advantage of this and I didn't I think I paid like $16 I didn't pay um $20 for that so that's gonna go where the other one went above my mantle and then let's see let's grab all from big lots first okay then weeks ago I only got a couple of things I have been wanting us to get some new stockings forever so I finally got us some I wanted some before we even moved into this house and at the time they did not have all I don't remember when I did the shot with me if they had all the same color but that's okay so two of them or this ivory color they were eight dollars and I had a coupon this day too so I think they were like six dollars and some change um, for these so two of these which would be mine and Jason's the ivory color and then the other three will be the boys stocking and the traditional red so I thought these were so cute with the fur for eight dollars well they were less than eight dollars with a coupon and then mama and i went to marshall's and i think i picked up a couple yeah two three some other things some christmas gifts and i love marshall's for christmas shopping for the boys because i can easily just go to department department for them and they always have like so many different types of of course home decor but gifts so um yeah, I can't say because the other person sitting right out there what I got. But um, what I'm going to do too, guys, is I always been wanting to do a gift guide. And I never did one on camera for you guys because I never sh I never have all their gifts together in order to share with you a gift guide. So now that I blog or now that I'm a blogger, I know how to do or they taught us how to do a gift guide um, on a blog. So, I'm creating a gift guide based off of presents that are things that I have bought my boys in the past and what they currently like and my husband because I always see gift guides for women and also for a different type of guy likes. Like my husband, he is a gamer and a, a fitness fanatic. So, I don't see a lot of videos on uh, gift guides on that. So, I'll be sharing with that soon. Probably in the community tab. So make sure you check that often. Okay, so Marshalls, this was $9.99, and this is Quill to Paper. And I thought it was cute because it had a little red truck, and it was um, rustic and everything. So I picked that up, and it does have like a thing where you can hook it on the wall. But I'm probably just sit it on the counter or something. 
or on a table so I did see these weeks ago I didn't haul it because I had like a lot of essential stuff that I needed to pick up from Dollar Tree and I picked up four of these and um, I don't even know if I'm going to use these or not but I just grabbed them I don't know I you'll see that I picked up a lot of Buffalo check with the white and black and with the red and black so yeah I'm trying not to talk too much to you guys because I got a lot of stuff to cover. <laughs> also, as well, I was following somebody on Instagram and she posted, um, well, I actually thought these were pillows. I didn't realize they were pillow, um, pillow slips or cases. I guess they're pillow cases. And, um, they're really nice made. They're Buffalo Check. And these are off of Amazon. So, I will make sure, I'm sure I know where I got the link from and I will put it below but you get two of them in there I think they're only like $11 so at first I was like oh they're not the pillow which I think I knew that because she also pointed out where you can buy these mini size pillows um in white a four pack and my mom was like well you got plenty of pillows all you gotta do is just put them in there and I was like oh yeah so I don't know if I'm gonna get any more or not and I'm not positive again if I'm going to have this thing or the red and black thing. As well, I picked up from Amazon this runner. And this will be on my breakfast nook table. I'm not going to do our everyday eating table. I'm not going to do this in my main dining room. So this is going to be, I don't even know the length guys. But I'll put the link below to Amazon. And it's folded in half. And they also had some napkins and... They got them in stock and they kept saying they'll run out and they ran out again. So all they have is blue and I think like a red, like a picnic red, but not like a Christmas buffalo black check red. So, yeah. And I'm in my lounge clothes, guys. So some of you that shop at Walmart, like I've been shopping for my clothes at Walmart forever because I used to be that girl that would spend hundred dollars on an outfit or it was just me and trail then and I wasn't married and then I used to be that girl that would just oh all my clothes had to come from Lane Bryant or from a certain store but I've been shopping at Walmart <laughs> and I started to see these videos of people saying they shop at Walmart and I'm like I always shop at Walmart and somebody noticed that my PJs um, from the shirt was the same as hers and it was from Walmart and I got it for five dollars but these are new these are lounge clothes and um they have them in navy blue and another color black and it's another color but anyway i got mine in pink so i got my lounge clothes on chilling and jason's off to a panthers game with his um homies with his best friends and my mama she's gone too out of town so it's like both of my buddies is gone so i had to do some retail therapy today it was just me and saya and yeah Okay, guys, so I have on this, and this is from Michael's, and the little mailbox, I knew so I would get a kick out of it, and sure enough, that was the first thing he saw, and so um, when I went, they were just putting the stuff out, and they had plenty of these, this was the last one, reindeer, the little buffalo check reindeer, they were gone, and something else that I wanted, the jingle bell, so that might be the only thing, because I think I'm about done with um, shopping, but anyway, it has a door here. And it was $50, but it was 40% off. And then I had a Joann's competitive coupon. Coupon. They will take competitor coupons. So I used that too. So it was like $22.50, I believe, guys. Okay, so sorry for the rattling. I think this is... You know, I got some more stuff in bags. Um, I have been eyeing this. I also showed this in the Insta story that I wanted. It is... They look like faux logs, guys. So, I thought that these were cute. I'm sure Hobby Lobby, I think, has something similar to this I seen last year. I really haven't Christmas shopped in Hobby Lobby. Just to go in there to get planner stuff and leave. But this was $12. 40% off. Additional 25% off. So, I paid like $5 for these. And I picked up two of these. And I just wanted them by my mantle or somewhere um, really cute. Somewhere to make the area really cute super cute and all of this is styrofoam and they like wrapped it you probably can DIY this Look like they mod podged it put some glitter on it and stuff my child is playing 
WWE. Okay, so I also picked up, and I'll do a close-up shot of this, the crafting tape. And I'm just showing it because it's in the bag. But I did show on my Instagram where I have like this black craft bag that is organized. And I'm going to do a video of that and what's in it. And I'm trying not to buy too many new Christmas craft things. But some things I am buying because I want to have all my stuff together so that I can make Christmas cards and also do any Christmas crafting but of course what did I want to say December daily so I want to try to do that I want to be a little bit laid back in December and um, get my goals together and stuff that I want to do and spend time with my family and so forth but anyway that's what these look like guys I know you probably can't see them so I'm gonna do a close-up of them they were buy one get one half and additional 25% off um, I picked up the Tombow permanent adhesive tape runner refill and I haven't picked these up in a long time and I needed some more so this is just like a adhesive tape and then um I did not show that haul because I had so much stuff planner and craft stuff that I've been picking up and I haven't edited it because I'm looking at the views and I shouldn't look at the views though because I know if you guys say you want to look at it you want to look at it but um I haven't shown this I don't think yet um, this is the only paper pad that I did not have. I think Kendra 504 Pretty Things posted all the paper pads, the Christmas ones. 70% off, $4.99 for something. I don't know if it's an additional 25% off or not. But I got all the other ones except this one. And it was one more I didn't like. Okay. Don't fall light. Okay, guys, so I went back to Dollar General. I've been stalking. Not stalking too much, but I've just been trying to give them time to put out stuff. I did go to the one in my hometown, and that one was like a disaster. Not disaster, but they had like all their pallets lined up against the Christmas stuff. So I did see a couple of new things, which is back behind the couch. I have to get up and get it, and I'll get to that in one second, but... They didn't have too much in there. I kind of knew what was repetitive and what was new. So, in my local one, I did see that they put out some plates. These are, um, usually Dollar General has some party plates in their party section. They have a small party section. Um, this is eight count here, and it just has like the holly leaves with some plaid. And then they have the red poncettas with the, um, pine cones I think I picked up two of these and then <clears throat> two of these the eight count and then they had the oval plates which they cost more this was the eight count for 275 I like these not for 275 but I still liked it I just guess I was being cheap but Dollar General does have a coupon if you can wait to the weekend, which I should have. But I go when I feel like it and when I have time. <laughs> and on the coupon at the end of the receipt when you check out, it's usually on a Saturday. It's 5 off of 25 And you can get some really good deals if you coupon there. I really never sat down, even when I was like hauling big time couponer at Dollar General. But... I know some people who really get some real good dis discounts on cleaning supplies from there. I also picked up the large napkins. And I think they had luncheon, but I'm not sure. And those were a dollar each. I also picked up these fabric bags. And I picked up some the other day first. And then I picked these up yesterday. And these are good for like little presents if you're giving away like at school. Um, friend mail planner buddy mail or whatever or you can um of course for your family or something like that or just um maybe for a tablescape or something like that so i just picked them up anyway the buffalo check and then this one i think i picked this one and this one up the other day this one is a snowman that says let it snow and that is it guys out of that bag i'm talking about that is it okay guys sorry so i got sasa a little christmas tree for his room he asked for a christmas tree my child is so grown 
So I'm going to put that in his room as long as he doesn't. Well, if he topples it over, he, he won't hurt anybody. Okay. So from Dollar Tree, guys, as well, I saw these LED pillar candles. And these, I like these because I've used these in my house. Um, especially for decor and so forth and it's like this ivory color but it has like these little silver dots um, on them so I don't know if you guys can see that or not and I'll do a close up if you can't let's see let's get everything from Dollar Tree so I don't be going back and forth I just picked up some of these wired garland ties to make this tree a little bit <laughs> thicker and um yeah that's why i picked that up i probably had some from previous years but i wasn't sure and then i picked up him several of these little ornaments i noticed that they don't have a lot of blue ornaments so i think i picked up three of these for him to put on his little tree and then lastly i think in his bag from dollar tree a little christmas tree skirt so it doesn't matter if he has a skirt or not but i just picked that up for him then back to Marshall's this is the other thing I picked up I couldn't resist guys so these were $4.99 which I thought was a great price again this is from Marshall's and this had the buffalo check you get two of these tea like kitchen towels let's see yeah two of these kitchen towels and then you get one of like this terry cloth like one and then you get with the buffalo check dollar general i picked up this eight christmas cards with envelopes and these are pop-up cards so that's why you don't get so many and it's only one design in the box and then from dollar general i also picked up a lot of craft stuff for saya i really was looking for what else new they had out and I think I seen just about everything because I did watch some people's shot with me's is it shot with me yeah shot with me's okay so I saw these melamine decorative decorative decorated side plate they were two dollars each I think I picked up well the full, first store they were putting out the stuff the day that I went um they didn't put out everything but most of the stuff so yeah majority of it so i don't they only had four that day and then i think i went back to the one that had all the goodies and i just picked up two more these are the your little salad light -like plates these are not the large plates because i know sometimes on camera it may look larger but it's not the larger one actually has like a picture of a house and a deer and it's like a light baby blue and then the outside of it is this pattern here so those are melamine again those are two dollars and then on yesterday I picked up like some gift tags so I know I needed some more and I know that a lot of times Target one spot has a lot of cute ones Dollar Tree does too but seem like Dollar Tree doesn't start putting out or mine doesn't start putting out the cute tags or the gift bags and stuff until maybe the middle of November or something like that so I went ahead and picked up these gift tags and I don't really plan on going getting anything from the Target one spot only because I found so much at Dollar General and I think I spent enough for Christmas shop Christmas stuff um, other than presents right now so I picked up these these are really cute again I'll do a close up if you guys cannot see that these were a dollar as well I thought these were really nice these here this is no peaking do not open to December 25th and special delivery do not shake and rattle these here they were a dollar you get 16 in here and these here so these are more rustic they say Merry Christmas and so forth so these are really nice for like pocket letters if you're doing pocket letters or december daily for scrapbooking or something like that then i thought i like to have these little boxes even though you're not sure what you 
are gonna buy for Christmas but usually for my boys especially my oldest I usually buy him some type of jewelry because he likes that type of stuff and so this one says Merry Christmas Merry Christmas on the inside Merry Christmas here and I know when I got them that a lot of them were stuck together. I don't know if it was, it was the glue that it was made out of and shipping and so forth. Because this one was really pretty, but you can see like the glue because they were really stuck together. See, it's still stuck. So, these are really cute. And this one says, Season of Magic and Wonder. And they had some more too. But I only got... Those were a dollar. I only got two of them. I think I did go back and get one more of these ornaments. So, I have looked at the other stores. It seemed like we have a Dollar General within 10 minutes from each other. I know it's one local town that has like two on each side of the river. But I don't go down there either um, too much. Okay, so this decorative ribbon, I did pick up one of these. Yeah, I didn't show you guys this. The Buffalo Check. From Dollar General and this is nine feet so usually the dollar ribbon is nine feet I picked up this and I need to put it back in the bag in case he busts back in here the activity book with wooden stamps Rudolph the red-nosed reindeer and it has one puzzle book three stamps one ink pad and four markers I should put some chapstick on. And then as well, I picked up, he wanted this, the activity pack, play pack. And they usually have this at Dollar Tree for a dollar with Rudolph and everybody in it. So I wanted him to have some kind of crafts to do because, um, again, he's home with me until he goes to kindergarten. So we try to do some activities and so forth. And I need to work on that a little bit more um getting him out of the house like taking him to the library where they have reading time and stuff usually they have it at two o'clock on saturday well i don't know people's doing stuff on saturday but i'm gonna make my time to do that for preschoolers they have one during the week too though but anyway so um i also picked him up the diy wood character with base this one here the santa so he can color that and then this one here um this is an ornament, and this one is the deer and the snowman. And then this one here, <laughs> I just went DIY crazy. Probably because he likes to do, he likes to build, he likes to be creative. So at least he got that from me. Um, Cause JJ doesn't, and Trail doesn't really care for that either. And JJ would just come out and say, no mama. So um, foam snowflake ornaments, a DIY. So you just glue these little foam ornaments. And the string comes with it and everything. Pipe cleaners. This one here, I grabbed this and super quick. <laughs> this is the only one. And these were a dollar guys from Dollar General with the little truck. So he can build this and hot glue it or stick it together, give him some glue. It comes with, and actually it makes five different ornaments. So, not different, five little trucks. Which is a lot, actually. So, and these are ages three and up all of them yeah all of them three are up this one too so i'll probably let him i'm sure hang it on my tree don't worry about the way it looks this one is a little snowman and it comes with everything i did pick up another one of these mugs i'm still seeing plenty of these and you have to hand wash these and it says have a holly jolly christmas with the buffalo check and we're not coffee drinkers i wish i was i need to um to wake up sometimes or to get my day started but i just picked up two of these in case somebody wants some cocoa or something make a little cocoa bar for the family and i got one more bin guys this is a bin and let me speed this up so it won't be so long okay guys so from dollar general as well this, I went to my hometown and they had this pillow. So that was the one thing that I did find. She said, what are you looking for? And I said, oh, I'm just looking for what's different, what's new. I haven't seen it at the other stores. And I have not seen this at any other stores except the one in my hometown I grew up. 
with so it says Merry Christmas with the little dog, the black. Um Oh, it's on the tip of my tongue. But it looks like my neighbor's dog. With a little truck. And then it has the burlap. And then it's... Um, this was $8, guys. And that's the pattern on the back. So, I did see these um, at the one close to my hometown. Like, right down the road. And they had... I didn't need fluff it for you guys. But it's so pretty. <laughs> I was so lazy. Oh Lord, I didn't even fluff it. So it was five dollars, and um, so I did find a flock one. I didn't even find this at the one that I said it was down the road from me, but they have like a weight at the bottom with the burlap base, and then they have the flock one. I picked up two of these, and when I went back to the one down this road yesterday, when I got all the what did I get yesterday? Um. I don't remember what I got at the other one. It wasn't yesterday. It was the day before. Um, they did not have a lot of the flock ones. So I don't even know if the one right around the corner from me ever got them. But I know they go super quick. Okay, guys. So I did see this. Uh, another one I went to and the one around the corner from me. And I almost forgot. I went in the store to see what they had new and to get this because I know I saw it. But... I waited and I almost missed it because it was like pushback and I was like people been in here shopping because it was like four of them and it was only like one, like one left but I did see a bunch of them at the one last night yeah last night the other night the other night these were five dollars and this is just a countdown to Christmas and it just has like this galvanized numbers Here that you can turn and I like this so the side can go ahead and count down um, or the boys can count down or whatever so this is super cute for five dollars from Dollar General um let's see I hate to switch it up guys I think I'm about done though this is from Michaels I've been wanting some of these um, antlers forever and these were $4.99 I think it was a sale then but I got these like weeks ago when I got something else I don't remember what it was but um this is like on that aisle at Michaels where they have all of the picks and stuff and they have these like in gold I think maybe another natural color I'm not sure but I wanted this light color natural color and um these go fast because they didn't have them last year um especially in the natural so I think I got four of these picks not sure what I'm going to do with it yet. And then. I think. You guys seen that already. I think I was on Instagram. And I just went crazy with the doormats. With the doormats. And I was like. Well you got to have a place for, the, for them. And I know I put one inside my door. And then I'll put one out my back door. Because they take out the trash back there. But this one here. And it says bless his home and it's only five dollars for this one no six dollars for that one and then this one here with a little red truck and let me hurry up for my fire detector i don't know guys why the fire detector just bleep beats when it wants to because i bought some batteries for jason to change it and he was like, did you change it? And I was like, no, because you know I can't reach it. And, um, yeah, I shared all this, guys, before. And I was like, no, I haven't. And then now it just started beeping all of a sudden. I think I'm done, guys. Let's see. Like, I'm sorry for the digging. Oh, here's the other plates. You guys seen right here. Oh, yeah, I want to share these. I want to share because they're going to go like hotcakes. Okay, so from Walmart, guys. Yeah, I'm getting him to change that. These decorative monogram. Um, I picked some up from Walmart before and they were silver with gold. Which, the fallout is not too bad. From They may still have them. And they're $0.98 cent from Walmart. 
So I grabbed these really quick. I didn't plan on getting no Christmas stuff this, this particular day. And because we have so many J's in our family, I get the boys' middle initial. So this is Josiah's. Mm, this is JJ's. Um, this is Jason's. Mine and then Catrell's. So those are 98 cents to go on those stockings. And I'm trying to make sure I don't forget anything, guys. Because then I forget. And I'm like, oh, shoot. And then I picked up Saya some of these Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer books. They were a dollar. And they're different. This is Wonderful Winter. This one is Rudolph Helps Out. And what was this one? Very Merry Misfits. And I think they have some more. But I did and that's 2 plus age. But I didn't get those. And I did go back and get some more of these. So if I did cards, I didn't mind giving away my stickers or working with them. So I went ahead and picked up some of these vintage stickers. So I'll make sure I link that haul if you have not seen that. And then I think I showed you guys. Yeah, I did. I did. These are here. So I did show these in that other haul. And these are just some ornaments, a dollar. Oh, guys, and I did, I did, I found, I found one more. So when I found, I didn't even look to see if they had more. I did find the other placemat. So make sure you check out that other video because I did find the other placemat. And last, last two things, I picked up just out of these little party tote bags. I thought they were cute from the Dollar Tree. And with the Minions and Paw Patrol. And I thought these were cute. Like to put some toys in that I may not want to wrap. Or just something. Because they were a dollar. They're just little bags. And then lastly guys from Amazon. I'm so sorry guys. This is so out of order. But it's a collective haul. I picked up this Buffalo Check rug. So everybody's been posting these on Instagram. And I think Hobby Lobby has them. But they did not have it in my store. I don't know the dimensions guys. But I will put, I think it's 60 by 90 centimeters, but I don't know. Because it is from made in China, look, it's China, Chinese words. But anyway, I um this was 26 or $27. And usually what people are doing, so if you guys don't know, I'm just pretend. My other mat is over there that I showed in the, actually I have another haul from Dollar General before the last one that I did it was with a grocery haul so I made sure I put both of those below but pretend this is a rug and what they're doing is they're putting a rug a smaller doormat rug on top of the buffalo check rugs and the thing about the buffalo check you can use it any time of the year you can use it for Christmas time is really trendy and then people are using it for Halloween too but I don't decorate for Halloween. But it was really cute. And um, I was concerned about it getting dirty. But what I can do is buy some Scotch Guard from Walmart or Target. The spray. And see how that works and so forth. But yeah, I'll put a link down below to this. This was another thing that was going fast. Like sometimes they'll say quantity almost gone or whatever. And I couldn't find it at my Hobby Lobby. I figured I couldn't. But I really didn't look hard or whatever. But I think that's it, guys. I'll make sure I will upload. I will make sure that I will record that craft tote with everything in it and so forth. So, like, if you're doing a December daily or some kind of Christmas cards, that you will be have your stuff together so you won't be fumbling, like, where's my stamps and where's this and where's that. Because I'm trying to make sure I have everything together. And I did pick up, like, two or three things from Dollar General that's over there um like some scissors some pens and something else that's crafty like so I'll just share it all in that video so guys this was a huge haul I think I'm done because some of the stuff I forgot what I got last year and then I'm gonna start purging and I'm purging my fall stuff that I'm not using anymore and taking that to the Goodwill so okay guys I forgot to film this I did pick up this sign I was eyeing this at Michael's it's have yourself a merry little Christmas it's I usually don't pick up large signs but I think it's about 24 inches by 12 by 24 something like that 
and I can't remember how much it was, but I used the coupon 40% off. No, it was 40% off and then 25% off. And as well, I will insert a picture. I was in there and they were having their tree event. They have a slimline seven foot tree for $39.99. And then they have like a cashmere tree beside it for 49 mama wanted the 49 she wasn't with me so i remember that she wanted one and i said like mama they have their tree event and she doesn't have a lot of space so the slimline tree is perfect for her space in her living room and um what she did was she if you guys, I'm sure everybody knows about Cash App. So she just sent me over the money and then I paid for it for her. So um, I will insert a picture of that. It's a pre-lit tree and I think the event is to the weekend, but I'm not sure. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Sorry it was all over the place. I won't say it's all well. Sorry it was all the different stores and different places and um, it was. I just wanted to sit down with you guys, get in front of the camera, and um, do this more often so it would be more comfortable and so forth. But thanks so much for um, liking, commenting, and subscribing. Thank you to all my new subscribers. A couple of people have said, quite a few people have said, oh, I'm new to your channel. And thanks so much for su subscribing and sticking around. So don't forget to... Um, comment like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video and turn on that notification bell so you know anytime you get any new videos from me you'll be notified thanks for watching guys bye bye